right, crowd getting excited as this fight gets underway. And you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist. But on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true 5 2 player. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Really making good use of his reach advantage there with that punch. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a Whoa! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. And that one was heavy. And landing some nasty strikes. Straight right. Machida gets caught with that punch. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, big left. Blocks that strike. Oh, straight right. Now he stuns him beautifully with the left hand. The left hand is so accurate, so educated. He's so able to fight from both fighting stances. Big ball from punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Man, these knees are really starting to do a lot of damage to his opponent here tonight. And there's another one for good measure. Lands a knee there. Nice deception there to get that knee to the target. Really good knee. Nice job of driving his right to the target. Getting it to land exactly where you want it. Oh, nice combination. combination. Right there, his opponent's wobble chair. He's hurt bad. This dude needs to grab. He needs to wrestle. He has to do something. He cannot take another shot like that. Oh, and he gets tagged. Nice combination. Oh! Big punch lands over the top. I was going to follow this one. Oh! Huge right hand! Well, you know, I don't like the gi very much, but I have an appreciation and a healthy one for these type of transitions. You can tell he's been in a gi at some point in his life with the way that he moves so freely. I'm skipping jujitsu next week, too. <laughs> well, he's up, but he is hurting for certain. The finish could come at any time. He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement. Perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. Round two winding down. All right, the round is over. Round two is underway. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, and there is the kick. That one checked by Machida. Oh, good. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his oh! own hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Big knee there. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Punch over the top. Right on the button. Now he engages in a Muay Thai clinch. You better protect that head. Great job securing the Muay Thai clinch. Watch for big knees to the body, and eventually him switch it up with a big knee to the head. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. Absolutely brutal elbow.
elbow to stop his opponent here tonight. And this has clearly been a weapon that has been a part of his arsenal in his UFC career. But it takes a lot of repetitions in the gym and a lot of confidence to willingly throw elbows the way he did there. So a lot of force in a short distance. And when you execute it like that, it is absolutely devastating. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout victory. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 43 seconds of round number two. Playing the winner by knockout, Leo Toa Oh, well, there he is after a huge knockout win tonight. You going to the after party or what? I mean, I'm heading over there right now, John. <laughs> I'm asking the producers, how soon can I get up? This is going to be a party over there. Not only because of the knockout, but that extra bonus check he's going to be carrying to the club tonight.